hello, Diamond Divas. Merry Christmas to you and to me because I have a new Diamond Art Club painting um, that I got the minute it was released on Saturday because I had a store credit. And um, so I applied that store credit and I paid a little difference and I was like, hallelujah. So this one's really, really cool. Um, again, it's kind of a whimsical piece. So it might not be your style, but it is so my style. Um, very bright and colorful. And instead of showing you the box, I'm trying to keep the camera on the mount so that it's not so wiggly because apparently I shake like um, I'm going through DTs or something. I don't even know. But anyway, so I will show you the image here. All right. It is fabulous. It is called A World Awaits. It is a square diamond painting with some Aurora Borealis colors. And... It is 55 by 66 centimeters. You know I didn't do my conversion first, like an idiot. I forgot to look this up. So I will put the conversion to inches in the description um, because I'm a dodo bird. Anyway, you can see this is such a whimsical type piece. It is amazing. I am like obsessed with the colors, of course. Anything with a rainbowy type of you know color palette is gonna be all up in my alley, so um super excited of course what do i always say i gotta come up with another term besides super excited because like i don't know what else to say but it's like i'm super duper excited anyway huh. so let me breathe real quick um 43 gorgeous colors and we'll go through this a little bit better when i open up the canvas um, but let's look at what we've got in the kit they've changed a few things and i thought i'd point that out for you the canvas is you know, pretty large. So again, I'll open that up in a minute. Um, the drills, I don't want to open and crinkle and mess with, you know, but, oh my gosh. Oh, Y'all know, when I see these colors, I'm like, I'm like a kid in a candy store, but I'm like a kid in a diamond painting store and these are the drills and you get to fill up your little bags of drills instead of candy. Anyway, all right, I'm, I'm an idiot. But besides the point, they're fabulous, okay? Lots of gorgeous colors. Um, not gonna open that. You know how I hate that crinkling. They did include a few new things it looks like in our toolkit. Um, maybe one or two little things. Let's look at this. Because I noticed tweezers, and these are the fabulous tweezers that I got the other day in that other kit that I um, did a review on. And hello, these are fabulous. They're super heavy. That's the first time I've ever seen tweezers in their toolkit. Then we have, there might not be anything new other than that, but I'll show you what's in the toolkit because I rarely do that. Um, so you've got your wax heart. Of course, it's got to be a heart because it's precious and how much do we love diamond painting, right? All right. I'm a diamond painting nerd. All right. There are two of those. <laughs> there are some of the baggies, little zipper baggies, okay? And then our clear tray, which is nice. This is very much like the white ones that I've shown you before. Same size, same type, love them. They're great. They're not green, which is good. They also give you the little gripper tool to go on your diamond painting tool uh, pen. This is also on, um, included in the kit. It's the three drill, multi-drill. What is on my nail? Oh, I've been painting, sorry. Uh, multi-drill tool. So this is a really easy one to use because three drills um, is very controllable. I'm very happy with my three drill, multi-drill tool and four drill. I've gotten really in the habit of using that one too. I have a 10 and I haven't quite gotten the hang of that one yet, but, but any, anyway, this, this is a really good tool. So that's what's in your toolkit. Now let's open up this canvas so I can start squealing like a child on Christmas morning. Sorry. Let me mention this real quick. I did realize, finally, this could go down, like I said it before, in a book or something to keep up with all of your diamond paintings and the color palette and thing. But also, it is self-adhesive. It actually can peel off. So if you have your drills in a box, like they, they sell the round um, box, and I think it holds 24 of the little round containers or whatever, I think this can fit in there or on top of it or whatever. Um, I do like the fact that it is adhesive because it gives you a little bit of versatility for however you like to organize your, your diamond paintings. Okay, 
Now let's move on to our canvas. Now you'll notice I'm unrolling it. Um, it is, you know, very bent up. And when you first get it, you'll be like, oh my gosh, it's not gonna unroll. This is a velvet type of canvas. So as it lays flat for just a little bit, it actually, um, as it lays out, I should say unrolled for a little bit, it will actually lay flat on its own. So even though it looks like it is really rolled up, it is fine. Okay, so I'm actually having the, my camera mount is gonna hold down that edge for us. Um, and then I've got it all the way open. It's not gonna let us see everything and I'm gonna have to pan, but the problem is my shadow's kind of casting over it. I apologize for that. Um, but you see how yummy and delicious the colors are, oh my God. So this is just the cutest piece. I don't know, like I immediately saw it and went, oh my gosh, oh my God, I have a credit. I know what I'm buying. So I don't know how many pieces this makes from the Diamond Art Club. I'm almost afraid to count. I'm gonna be moving soon potentially and I will have to go through them all and see what I've got. But I wanna say I have at least 25 now. And um, I'm a little embarrassed about that. But they're fabulous. If I'm ever gonna invest money in a diamond painting, I can trust this company. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. The colors, the, the just the customer service. I ordered this on Saturday evening and I had it Wednesday morning. Okay, so that's how they ship. They're just super fast. I, I think the most I've ever waited for a diamond painting from them is maybe seven days. So that's the only time I've ever had a delay in anything I've ordered from Diamond Art Club. Now I am in the US, obviously. Um, I believe this company comes from, I wanna say New Jersey, and I live in South Carolina, so I definitely am on the East Coast with them, so it's not that far. But even if you lived in California or somewhere like that, I don't think it would take more than a week, but you can trust them, that's what's so important. Um, I want to say, I'm actually not even sure what I paid for this, but I will tell you this, there are a ton, ton of the diamond paintings that I have shown you in my videos lately that are on sale. They never go on sale. Now they might have a, a coupon sometimes, but rarely will you see these go on sale. So if you see these marked down, any of the ones that I've shown you, go get them. I think one of the princess ones I just posted, it uh, is like $29.99 and I probably paid 50 for it. So, you know, guys, I know it's Christmas time. You're not probably wanting to buy for yourself, but Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas to me. And why not? Why not treat yourself once in a while? Um, okay, so anyway, I hope you have been given a good view of this uh, by like I said, me not holding it and not really being able to pan it like I want um, to show you details. So I might try to zoom in a little as I'm talking, but how Freaking amazing is this. Oh, okay. Nerdy Melanie is about to check out here. I just wanna say, you guys who've been loyal to me, thank you so much for sticking with me and subscribing to my channel. Thank you for giving me a thumbs up instead of a thumbs down on my videos because sometimes I know they might get a little bit redundant or monotonous, but um, I really appreciate you guys being kind with your comments. I do want you to please join the group. I have a new link in the bottom for the group for Facebook. It is a brand new group. So if you guys want to go and share your diamond paintings, your work, works in progress, paint by numbers, those work in progress, we can share companies that we like, what we, you know, the kind of pass or fail, the ones you've had horrible experiences with, the ones you've had great experiences with. And the beauty of it is, I'm not affiliated with a company, so you're not gonna be upsetting me if you say, oh, I had a horrible experience at this place, this place. I mean, I don't care. We just need to share that with each other as consumers so that we know who we can trust. All right, guys, love ya. Hope to see you back soon. Don't forget, if you haven't already, to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and share my videos, um, and go join the group. Thank you, as always, for watching.